Denver's apartment market enjoyed a very strong 2010 as the Mile High City came near or even surpassed decade highs for rent growth, occupancy growth, and apartment demand. Welcome to Apartment Market Dynamics from MPF Research. I'm Jay Parsons with your Denver Update. At the beginning of 2010, Denver emerged as one of the first major markets to start pushing up rents, and that continued through most of the year. And while same-store rental rates fell just slightly in fourth quarter, the increases early in the year were more than enough to push rents up significantly in 2010. In fact, one of the biggest increases seen nationally, up 4.6%. That is one of the better performance Denver has seen in the past decade, with a notable exception of the big run-up in 2007. So, how did that happen? What's driving up rents? Well, it certainly helps when apartment demand is reaching decade highs. 8,700 units absorbed in 2010. That is the high over the past decade. And as you might expect, occupancy is moving up, up as well. Occupancy is now at 94.7%, pretty much in line with pre-recession levels. Occupancy did hold steady in fourth quarter, on par with a third quarter rate, but even that was good. In fact, in the past 15 years, Denver has recorded occupancy losses in fourth quarter, but that streak came to an end in fourth quarter 2010. So in this case, flat is pretty good news. And on an annual basis, in 2010 as a whole, occupancy improved 2.4 points, and that too was the biggest improvement in about 15 years. And as we've done with all of our videos, we've been telling you that the markets that have been really standing out across the country have been the ones that have seen improvement at all product age categories, all product classes, and every submarket. And that's what helps Denver really stand out with the nation's elite as well. Every product age group recorded revenue growth in the past year of at least 6%, and every submarket recorded revenue growth of around 4% or more. Let's give you a few submarkets to think about, starting with a big winner, the tech center. Big occupancy growth and big rent growth. Occupancy jumped 5.1 points in 2010, and same-store rents climbed 6.4%. That adds up to revenue growth of a very impressive 11.5% easily the best in the Denver area. And one thing we want to mention here is this is not some sort of statistical aberration. We looked at the property level data and pretty much every property recorded significant improvement in 2010. Another one for you, moving up I-25 up to the urban core in town Denver. Couldn't match that occupancy growth, but big rent growth in in-town Denver. Same store rents up 6.6%. This is already the most expensive submarket in the Denver area, and that gap widened even further. Occupancy in the in-town area is now at 94.5%, up one point annually. And one more for you, Boulder, the university area had a very good 2010. Uh, the, uh, it leads the region with an occupancy rate of 97.1%, very tight, and that's up 2.8 points annually, and same-store rental rates improved 5.8%. And that wraps us up for Denver, so until next time for Apart Market Dynamics and MPF Research, I'm Jay Parsons. Thank you for watching. Want more? Go deeper with NPF Research's Apartment Market Reports. From a national level, down to individual metros, to specific neighborhoods, MPF Research has been providing unparalleled apartment market intelligence to the multifamily industry for almost five decades. Learn more by contacting us at 877-284-4938 or visit www.npfresearch.com and click on Market Reports.